Spend wisely, save wisely, invest your money. The capital market is just is an integral part of life uh, because money and managing your money uh, is an integral part of life. What the capital market does is really provide you uh, medium to long term financing. So let's start with the nation. If um, you need to raise money for roads, for airports, for railway and all of that, uh, most likely the government will not have enough money itself. So the capital market provides a market where people who have money can provide that money uh, to the government in the form of a loan called a bond. Um, from the perspective uh, of an individual businessman who's looking to grow their business or looking to start a new business, what the capital market provides is an opportunity for you to have people who have money, excess money that they would like to invest, um, uh, provide that money over the medium to long term so that you can grow your business. What the capital markets can do is help create wealth, but also help the distribution of wealth. Uh, and so some of even the security challenges that we face in Nigeria today, we can start to address them. The Securities and Exchange Commission is uh, its the apex regulator. Uh, uh, so if you've got a market, you've got someone who actually oversees the functioning of the market. SEC has the responsibility of uh, um, regulating the market and developing the market. It's a dual mandate. Um, Rulemaking enables a lot of things, but the principle is the underlying protection of the investors who participate in the marketplace. Before you can become a market participant, SEC would have basically qualified you. Today we give exams to people to make sure that they understand what their responsibilities are. Everybody who participates in this market must feel that they have a fair chance, they can make money legitimately, people will not take advantage of them, um, and that you know they will be given full information okay, to make the decisions that they need to make about investments. Um, I believe that structure that has been put in place has helped uh, uh, investors to have better confidence in participating in the market. It is the confidence in the market that the investors have. That is why the market is still there. We're the largest economy uh, in Africa. Uh, clearly, there's a good reason why we should have the largest capital market in Africa, uh, because we also have the largest population. Uh, and therefore, if um, a country like South Africa, that is the second largest economy, has a much larger uh, capital market than us, uh, uh, the stock market is uh, about uh, 12 to 15 times the size of the Nigerian stock market. Uh, my aspiration is that we get to a point where at least the value of our capital market is the same as our GDP, that we, we get to a point where 100% of our GDP is what the stock market uh, should be. And I would expect that within a period of about 10, Yes, this should be the largest capital markets, firstly in Africa. But when you go, uh, you know, as you're driving into Abuja, you will say, oh, I bought the bond that was used to build this road. Or, with the great work that His Excellency President Goodluck Abele Jonathan has done, you know, a young person would have set up uh, our own uh, Alibaba, and all of us would be falling all over ourselves so that we can invest uh, in that. that is my aspiration, that is my hope as to where we'll be in 10 years time because of the solid foundation that we have laid today.